Hi, my name is Ryan Barrett, and I'm a product manager at National Instruments for our PXI Express 5641R Rio IF transceiver. And what this product is, is basically a LabVIEW programmable FPGA coupled to high speed, high performance analog inputs and outputs, which are optimized for intermediate frequency communication signals. I've got a demo for you here today where we have two 5641Rs in our PXI chassis here. Uh, one of them connected to an up converter, the other connected to a down converter. Now in the first 5641R, we're actually sending it an MPEG-2 transport stream, which we're then modulating on the FPGA, um, and then sending out the analog output, and up converting and sending out over the air to our television here. And the signal that we're actually transmitting is an 8 megahertz wide DVB-T television signal. Uh, the signal is QAM modulated and OFDM, and it's centered at 474 megahertz. Uh, the TV is then acquiring that signal um, and doing the demodulation and obviously displaying the picture here. Now on the second FPGA, we've actually implemented a real-time spectrum analyzer. And in a real-time spectrum analyzer, we basically perform FFTs on all of the incoming samples. Now this is different from a swept spectrum analyzer where we're only looking at one frequency at any given time. In a real-time spectrum analyzer, we're effectively looking at all frequencies over a certain bandwidth overall time. Now this is all being done on the FPGA, but there's also some room for some other fe uh, features. For instance, we have a frequency mask where we're comparing each bin of the FFT to a certain amplitude. Now here it's just a constant value, but that could be changed to any arbitrary frequency mask we like. Um, and we could also change the amplitude in real time, so as we drop that below the amplitude of our signal, we can see the FPGA indicating that we've exceeded our frequency mask. We also have the ability to do a maximum or peak hold. So once we set that, uh, we're actually tracking the maximum amplitude we see on any given FFT bin and displaying that here on a graph. We can also reset it and see uh, over time, uh, spurious signals will cause that peak amplitude to increase. Well, that's all I have for you here today in our demo. Again, what we're showing off is the ability for LabVIEW FPGA to target our PXI Express hardware uh, and implement custom communication applications. Thank you very much.